I'm Yvonne. I'm Nicole. And we are here to answer a few questions about our processes and a little bit about our, our company. Um, basically, when clients reach out to us, our first process is to get to know them a little bit, their design style. Yeah, we love to get to know the clients because we're designing their home, so we need to know kind of what the family is like. And, and I feel like style. you're really good about asking the personable questions. Yeah. Like, what do your kids like to do mm -hmm. and what are their favorite colors and I like to kind of dig into their personalities and like what they like to do what makes them feel comfortable yeah. yeah so we try to get to know our clients as well as we can first and foremost just to make sure it's a good fit on both sides and from then on basically we start we specialize in new construction full furnish so the client's usually building a house and fully furnish it. And Nikki actually heads our our furniture side and I kind of had our new construction side. So the client would start off with me. We would pick out all the hard surfaces of the house and that can be done as quickly or as long as possible, right. depending on the client. A few clients yeah, it just depends on the person. We offer presentation style, so if the clients are too busy to be involved, we can just get to know options. them, present yeah. options. Mm -hmm. Some clients want to be more involved, which is great. Um, and, and the furniture side goes hand in hand. It so does. really, I'm over the furniture side, your hard surfaces, but we're really working. They're intermingling. To, yes, we're working together. Yeah. I can't. We can't put like one without the uh, other. Yeah, we can't. It yeah. needs to blend and it needs to be completely cohesive. Yeah. Generally, if people are, if, you know, always concerned about budget, everyone is. So we do try to kind of pick the hard surfaces first. And then we generally have a furniture meeting. Mm -hmm. And sometimes we'll throw out some hard surface ideas and get rid of them. Maybe mm -hmm. they, they don't go with the furniture. Just to kind of like mingle everything together. Also, lighting. Huge. We love lighting. Yeah. Lighting is my very favorite. Put all lighting. of your overage allowances into lighting. Yes. Please. Yes. Lighting and They always say kitchen and like appliances, but I don't lighting know. too. Don't I feel like lighting? you can get really good appliances I mean, for a decent price. Lighting. Yeah. There hello. We go. Beautiful. Yeah. That's my favorite fixture, by the way. Ollie's studio. I. <laughs> presented to every client and only a few the bubble light i yeah. see it on the mood boards continuously like there's a bubble light again like, I love finally it. someone said yes. i know <laughs> yes we love it so we usually like co-mingle the meetings mm -hmm. around four-way stage when the house is framed but not yet drywalled at that point mm -hmm. we still have an opportunity to change electrical if we want to splurge a little bit more on lighting, that's the time to do it. Right. Work it into our furniture floor plan. So once we get the kind of the furniture started, mm -hmm. I feel like hard surfaces begin to get wrapped up mingle. at that point. Yeah. And then you do a really good job going through. Furniture is very detailed, you guys. Yeah, it's very detailed. We try to get every sample that we possibly can yeah. so our clients can just really feel touch and like be involved and we love our clients to sit on like couches sectionals lay on beds like I don't know feeling yeah. and touching and being like involved is so important because mood boards are beautiful yeah. but they don't do it justice like for instance this bed it's completely textured and amazing yeah. and you would never you can't tell you can't picture. yeah so it's good for clients to really like see as many samples as they can and Nikki's samples. located in Salt Lake primarily mm -hmm. so often we'll send clients up to kind of go shopping with her and, well, and a lot of our things. clients live in Salt Lake and they're yeah. building a second home so it kind of like yeah works out perfectly they're not by coastal they're by by Utah, I don't know. Northern, Southern. Let's coin that term. I don't know, who knows. But we do like to get the furniture ordered very early, um, like six months minimum. Mm -hmm. So generally, sometimes on these bigger houses, obviously you have plenty of time, but some builders build their houses very fast and mm -hmm. you sometimes have to start furniture at like permits. Yeah, well, honestly though, like, I feel like furniture just has to be intermingled with yeah. like hard surfaces, honestly, if you want to feel that cohesive feel, and that's kind of what yeah. our goal is. So. 
So basically, once we put a presentation together, we present to the client. There mm -hmm. might be like a few There's a couple flops of sometimes. Yeah. We've had clients like fully be like, I love it. Mm -hmm. And that's like our dream client. So if you're that person, we, we want you. We kind of are really lucky though. Awesome. I feel like I really try and push Certain clients things. to just kind of step out of their comfort zone because that helps you just get like this awesome, amazing look. Yeah. And it's like... Don't Why get not? stuck on one thing, mm -hmm. you know. Some clients will say, oh, I'm not sure on that one piece, yeah. but at the end of the job, they're like, that's, it, it makes the it room, together. and we're yeah. like, we told you. And obviously, if it's a, like, fun, crazy piece, it's not going to be a high-end item. It's going to be something you can swap out, but, like, it's actually, yeah. like. We're not married to it. We're just dating it. Yes. Right? We're dating. We're just dating, dating it for dating. a few years. It's not going to be like this big, huge investment piece, so yeah. you can swap it out like very easily. Yeah. But but always fun. say yes to those pieces because often that's why you're hiring a designer. Mm -hmm. um, it's kind of what sets us, us apart. Yeah, don't you feel like? Yeah, we're a little like the crazy pieces. You feel traditional. Like? I know. I kind of do. I love them. I kind of do throw on the funky. But you do. so once we present, we get things ordered. Um, we generally like to have the furniture ordered within 48 to 72 mm -hmm. hours of the presentation. Yeah. Um, right now, if that's not the case, by the time we go to order it, it's gone. Mm -hmm. Or the price is different or it's back ordered another six months. Like it's yeah. ridiculous. So right basically now. it's like 48 hours once we present mm -hmm. and we're ordering just so you get what you decided you wanted. On. Yeah. Mm -hmm. And then we're just at the mercy of shipping yeah <laughs> we won't even talk about that We're not but about that. basically then once the house is getting wrapped up the nice thing is we generally stage the home mm -hmm. we like to have the clients come in once it's finished mm -hmm. and we just love to see their children's yes. faces is my favorite part like my seeing favorite the kids come yes in. my favorite thing is to get to know your kids mm -hmm. like I love the babies. Yeah, they're so seeing sweet. them through their rooms. They're so the excited. And they get excited about the cutest, funny things. Yeah. Our last year's braid. Yeah. Our cute The spear darling. pillow. The spear pillow. Who knew? And the, pillow. the llama lamp. Yeah. She loved the llama lamp. Yeah. Anyway, it's just cute. And it's fun. So. Yeah. But we love working, you know, with our clients. Mm -hmm. And we're just so lucky. We're lucky. So thank you. Thank you, guys. You're the best job ever. <laughs>